your breath because this is extraordinary just getting the slightest touch and that was enough the car dug into the grass grass was on the inside uh. Locks view, he's got a hand on the outside of him, look. At Verda, it could have been about three or four BMWs white. Fellow Mercedes-Benz driver Vietoris pushes Joey Hand into the Brits car. a second on them, spin further back there, and uh, that has caused Carnage Jamie Green has got off into the ground. Well, he's the biggest idiot I've ever met. He's already a stupid idiot. That brought about the safety car. Robin Fryne's understeering, absolutely no grip as he came through and narrow. He's now the leading pit stopper, but he's got a gang of three right behind him. And around oh. the top with the two. This was the moment that Robin Freins dived down the inside of Ferdinand Hamsberg, though, after following the Austrian for several laps. The smallest of touches from Nico Muller was enough to send Timo Glock into that pirouette, and he held onto it beautifully, doing a complete 360. is the point you made that if you just get one wheel onto that grass and sand, you're in trouble, Lee. And that's exactly what happened to Augusto Farfus. Uh, and that looks like a hit from Danny Uncadella, which uh, sends Farfus over there. Now, this being an old school track, there's not lots of runoff area, so clatters into the barrier, pushed towards the uh, grass there a little bit, and then hasn't to hold on for all he can. Blue, we've seen that happen before in this same place. Whoa, and uh, we go on board just as he goes around. Extraordinary that we were actually on board with Matthias Ekstrom as he uh, turned around. Now Bruno Spengler riding on board with him at the start. What an incredible getaway he had. And he completely turned in on me in the first corner and I had to go over the, the Ludwig curb to, to not make contact. The next corner he completely just takes me out of the race, so I mean I have no idea what he was thinking. So Johnny Green. Johnny Green and full lock on. Car yeah. is understeering, Ooh. oversteering. Whoa. Then we see the crash in the front with uh, Robert Wickens. Back of the field, a replay on board with Nico Muller. Look to the left of your picture, that is where Ras tries to come around the outside. The slightest of touches. A replay on board with front row starter Sheldon van der Linde. An absolutely terrific start for René Rast, slicing into the lead. Habsburg with a great start. And there was the contact between Glock and Habsburg. A replay from Nico Muller showing the moment it all went wrong. A second it took for six cars to come past him. And suddenly a lot of work to do for the driver of the Delta Championship all the way from the beginning of the season. A penalty for that little collision uh, with his BMW brand mate. Sheldon van der Linde. So, understeering, there was very little Bruno could do.